Installing your new Kivo Smart Lock is simple and easy. Before you start, please gather all tools and materials required and familiarize yourself with the lock parts. Do not use an electric drill or electric screwdriver to tighten the screws. Step 1. Adjust the back set. Extend the latch bolt by rotating the D-shaped crank so the curve is facing up. Hold the latch in front of the door hole with the latch face flush against the door edge. If the D-shaped crank is centered in the hole, then no adjustment is required. If the D-shaped crank isn't centered, twist the latch to the longer setting. Step 2. Install the latch and strike. To properly position the latch, make sure the word up is facing upward. Install the latch in the door with the shorter wood screws provided. Or if using the drive-in latch with the bolt retracted, use a hammer and wood block to tap into position. Re-extend the latch bolt. Attach the strike with the two long screws and two short screws provided, making sure to install the longer screws closest to the door jamb. Step 3. Install the exterior deadbolt. Measure the diameter of the borehole. If the diameter is 2 and 1 8 of an inch, you will need to attach the provided adapter ring to the deadbolt as shown. For diameters that measure 1 and 1 half inch, you will not need the adapter. Holding the deadbolt with its logo upright, route the cable underneath the latch. Insert the torque blade through the latch by aligning the D shape of the torque blade with the crank. Firmly position the exterior deadbolt onto the door. Step 4. Install the mounting plate. Thread the cable and torque plate through the center hole of the mounting plate and position the mounting plate so it's flush against the door. Slide the cable into the small notch below the center hole. Secure the mounting plate to the door so that it's parallel with the door edge. Step 5. Install the interior assembly. Make certain the turnpiece on the interior assembly is in the vertical position. Remove the cover and battery pack. Push the blue connector onto the ports of the interior assembly. Make sure the connector clicks into place. Tuck the cable into the interior housing. Note, if you need to remove the cable, you may use the lever on the connector to pull it out of the interior assembly. Align the torque blade with the turnpiece shaft and push the interior assembly flush against the door. Insert the small screws into the lower holes on the interior assembly and tighten to secure the interior assembly to the mounting plate. Step 6. Handing the deadbolt. This step is crucial for proper operation. With the batteries properly installed in the battery pack, press and hold the program button while inserting the battery pack. Once the battery pack is installed, you will hear a long beep. Press the program button again. The lock will perform a door handing process during which it will retract and extend the deadbolt latch to determine proper handing. The status LED will blink green when the process is complete. If the status LED blinks red, remove the battery pack and repeat this step. Step 7. Pair your smartphone to your Kivo Smart Lock. Follow the instructions inside the Kivo app to create an account, enroll your first smartphone, and send e-keys to family and friends. Step 8. Install the interior cover. The interior cover will be installed over the interior assembly with three screws. The window on the interior cover is locked by default to prevent someone from tampering with your lock settings. If desired, you may remove the security screw from the window so that it can slide up for quick access to the buttons on the interior while the cover is installed. Your Kivo Smart Lock is now ready to use. For more information about your Kivo Smart Lock, visit our website or call our toll-free customer support number.